Hey guys, Full Cards here, live and direct from Brooklyn, New York, and today I'm going to focus on a box of the AHL for a change, which is uh, the 2016-17 Hobby Box, uh, and you can see there's five cards per pack, 20 packs per box. Uh, so the benefit of these, of course, it's the farm uh, teams of the players, and so it's all the prospects, etc. I think the boxes normally start around 40, 50 bucks, but invariably they dip down to 15, which is a good sort of price point to pounce on. Uh, you would get three autographs per box. I think in prior years there were five autographs, but three autographs are guaranteed nonetheless. Um, typically, I think they're sticker autographs. Then there are 20 base short prints. I believe they're red parallels and team mascots and some other uh, goodies within it. So the base runs one through 100. And the short prints are one per pack, I believe, and they're sort of the high number cards running from 101 through 150. So you can get uh, you know, known prospects like, like Kempe or um, Michael McCarron and Nikita Sherback if you're a Habs fan, um, Kevin LeBanc if you're a uh, San Jose Sharks fan, uh, some other ones, Hayden Fleury and Shea Theodore, uh, etc. So, you, so some could be perceived and conceived of as rookie cards if their rookie class uh, in the hockey card world was the same year was 2016-17. So they'd sort of be, I guess, considered sort of semi-rookie cards. Uh, so this is what the box looks like. It's actually a pretty nice looking box. And we have the, the uh, Tucson uh, Roadrunners on the top. And this, I believe, is a sticker. So they placed this one big sticker on the on the top of it, which is really sort of interesting, a little bit like a postcard in the back. But we do have this a decal, so that's nice. Um, so let's let's hammer through the box. You see what it looks like. Very nice little box. Uh, Twenty packs. So we look be looking for the Joe Hicketts of the world um, and and others like Riley Barber and. Um, so other goodies, I think maybe Chris Terry, I'm not really sure, we shall see. Chris Terry was actually one of the uh, point leaders, I think, in this year. But let's see, there's Chris Lazar, there's Yanni Gord, so that's a nice one to get. A Yanni Gord who, of course, uh, developed somewhat a bit late uh, and uh, is now with the Tampa Bay Lightning. There's Hayden Fleury, and here is our mascot. Our first mascot is a Kingston uh, mascot. Kyle Wood. Ah, our first auto. So the autos are just inserted randomly, and we got Aaron Palaszczuk. We got an Aaron Palaszczuk. That's, I've already, already got his, his auto. I got it from 2000, uh, what was it, 13, 14. But this is a Canadian's prospect, so it's always nice to get the Habs prospects. Um, I, I don't think he made any type of splash in the NHL, but again, Habs prospects are exactly what I would be looking for. That's, that's kind of cool. So we got our first auto. We, we expect two more autos. Um, and I, I don't think he, let's see if he is a short print. So he's number 70. Short prints would be above 101. That would be our short prints. There's an auto in this pack too. So I'm going to leave that pack. We'll come to that in a bit. Just save a little bit of the suspense for myself to enjoy it a bit more. Uh, Andy Miel. Nick Paul, Adam Ernie, and we have Brandon DeFazio, uh, who would all be based. I don't actually, we should look to see. So for example, this one, the Hayden Flurry would be a short print. Uh, in every pack, we'll get a couple of those short prints. So I can sort of peel those off a bit, uh, peel those off to the side. Um, so yeah, short prints every, every pack, theoretically, we will get uh, a couple of those short prints. One of those short prints to be specific. D'Angelo, Bodie, and there's Antoine Bibo. And the short print would have been uh, the Anthony D'Angelo. Okay. Martel, JC Lippin. There's Zach Fucali. I believe Zach would be the, and there's, oh, there we have another mascot. I don't want to miss the mascots. 
um, and Trevor Carrick. So I believe it would be Zach Fucali would have been the short print. Uh, in other words, it's easy to complete the base that you probably can with a box or two of these, uh, but the difficulty will be the 101 through 150 to get those because they're a little bit rare. Of course, you could probably buy them online, the set online, fairly cheaply, given that these are fairly low-end uh, cards. Low, it's very low-end product. Okay, so we have Emil Poirier. We have uh, a couple of others, Andy Cobb. So I believe it would be this guy, Tolchinsky, would be the short print. Um, it's a fun product because it costs so little. Um, that's my, you know, I like keeping track of the uh, prospects, um, typically. So there's Brandon Ranford, there's Griffin Ran Reinhardt, John Coenville, and he might be the short print. Let's see, it would be him, in fact. There's Scott Wedgwood. Joel Erickson, Ryan Hamilton, and again, it would be Joel Erickson. Eck. J-E-K. Or J-E-E. -E. Craig Cunningham. There's Anthony Mantha. And Michael Bornevel, who was another Habs prospect, and indeed Anthony Mantha would be the short print. So definitely mascots. Uh, in prior years, they focused on the logos. They had sticker logos um, and, and emblems and stuff like that. There's Riley Barber. And it would, in fact, be Riley Barber. Cole Schneider, and it would be Chase DeLeo. Mueller, Mark McNeil, Brandon Montour, probably him I'm gathering. Oh, UC Saros, might be UC Saros. No, it would be, oh, this one. Oh, it's another. It's another one of the mascots. Look at this dude, T-Bone. Interesting. And it would in fact be Brandon Montour. I had Brandon Montour in my, in my pool last year. I really like Brandon Montour. I think he's a very solid defenseman. Uh, really sort of, I guess, undervalued. I sort of like those guys, some of these stay-at-home guys who uh, very quietly put up very solid numbers on D. It's sort of a lost art. Michael Latta. There's Palishaj, his base card. Here's an Alexander Nylander. And he indeed would be the short print. Okay, guys, still looking for, oh, there's something in here. I'm gonna leave that aside. I guarantee three autos. I think we've gotten two. Oh, no, we, yeah, we got two, one of which we haven't looked at. There's Sully. I'm not Sully, who landed the plane on the Hudson. It'd have to be a different Sully. Fairly sir, I mean, Sully looks a little bit like that, the guy let the uh, pilot. Uh, certainly he's got his game face on. He's got his, I'm going to land it. I'm going to land this bad boy without any casualties face. Oh, there's Nick Patan. Oh, so we got another auto here. And it would be Andy Miel. Uh, and he would be 57. So he's another, I guess, a... a more of a generic one, but he's definitely a prospect, which is kind of cool. And you can see his numbers. He actually put up some really good numbers with Grand Rapids. So it'll be interesting to see how he does uh, in the NHL. 
he also is a center. Um, I'm not really sure how he's done thus far. Uh, I could sort of take a quick poke. Um, and he will elite prospect. Um, let's see what, what he's done thus far. So he's mostly been, he's been with the Grand Rapids Griffins. Uh, he's been playing in the KHL thus far. He actually looked okay in the KHL, I guess. Uh, I'm not sure what he was drafted though. Okay, so let's let's see who else we have here. We have Galiev. We have Jake Gunsel. Now he would be an auto we'd like. I don't know if his auto is available. There's Sonny Milano. And again, the high print would be Sonny Milano. Uh, did I miss did I miss one of the maybe not. Okay. Always interesting. Three autos. I preferred the prior year with, with the uh, Five autos. I mean, that was just just great. There's Alex Tuck. Oh, another auto. We got Tristan Jerry. Wow, I think we over delivered in autos. I think we got four autos. Whoa, Tristan Jerry's actually a really good one to get. Wow, out of nowhere. That's nice. Okay, so I have a couple of packs left. Um, let me just see. I think I missed a couple of the high number ones. I'm just, just trying to put them aside. Uh, maybe just taking a quick poke, you'll excuse me. These are not, none of these are high numbered, I believe. Oh, here's one, here's one of those, a mascot, I believe. There's a high numbered one. Tristan Jerry, that's a good one to get. He definitely got a lot of action last year. Uh, I'm curious how we'll do, we'll see. Um, so let's see, I thought I saw an auto. Oh, yeah, I do have another auto in here. Okay, so let's see who it is. We have a one auto left, and it's Jordan Smaltz we got here. We got Mirko Mueller. We have Rourke Chartier. We have Colin Greening. We have, yes, we still have Rourke Chartier. And we have Trevor Carrick, another decent one. Okay, cool. So it's good to get some prospects. Are any of these high numbered short prints? There's only one way to find out. Yeah, so the Tristan Jerry actually would be a short print auto. Cool. Okay, and we had one other thing where I thought, I think I thought I saw something. So uh, let's see whether it's a putty cat. Um, here we go. So, Kasperi Kapanen, we got Matthew Ford, Mackenzie Snapsky, we got Malcolm Subban, that's nice, and this looks to be a printing plate, and it's a Danny Cristo printing plate. I, I didn't even know they inserted these bad boys. It's a one of one. We got a one of one printing plate out of nowhere, a Danny Cristo printing plate. That is beautiful. Um, I'm going to take a peek at these as well just to see. So I'm going to see what these printing plates are all about. Printing plates are parallels uh, and they are one of one. So they exist, uh, they're inserts one of one. So in other words, you just have to be super lucky to get them. Uh, I didn't even know that they inserted these bad boys. So it just, it, I just happened to randomly get one of these packs. You're certainly not guaranteed it. You're guaranteed three autographs, 20 base short prints, three uh, red parallels. I haven't even looked for the red parallels, uh, 14 mascots, and one window clinger, essentially emblems. And maybe that's what, maybe that's what this was, duh. Okay. Brilliant. Um, so so that's it, guys. So let me do a quick recap. This was actually a really interesting involved box, a lot different than um, prior things I've, I've gotten. So let's see what we have here. Uh, we were guaranteed uh, three autos, and we were guaranteed um, one short print per pack. So we got a bunch of the short prints, of course, one per pack. And I can run through them. We did the, get the Zach Fucali, uh, the Erickson Eck, and the M Mantha. Uh, Brandon Montour, who is one of my favorite players, and Nick Patan and Sonny Milano, and a few other ones like Alex Tuck 
and the Jack uh, Roslevic uh, was actually a parallel. Um, so with regard to the red parallels, we got uh, three of them, one of which was a high numbered car. We got the Jack Roslevic, uh, we got the Adam Ernie, or Earn, and we got the Matthew Bodie. So those would be our three red parallels. That's new to AHL, they, don't, they didn't have that before. We did get the window clinger, of course, which is the sticker. I don't, I don't really drive much anymore because I'm in New York, so I don't usually use these bad boy stickers. Uh, in terms of the um, the mascots, we did in fact get one, two, three, four, five mascots. So that's pretty decent. It's a decent haul. Of the mascots we were actually guaranteed to get four, so we over delivered on the mascots. Um, Next, with regard to our autos, we were guaranteed three, and we got four autos. So it over-delivered. We got this one of Antti Miele. We got Aaron Palaszczuk, who's a Habs prospect. Uh, we have Trevor, uh, Trevor Carrick. Uh, and we got Tristan Jarry, which is a short print auto. So that was like a bonus. So we got four autos. And then, lo and behold, uh, I never gotten a printing plate before, uh, but we happened to get a one-of-one -one parallel of Danny Cristo, a Penguins prospect, uh, and we happened to get the Danny Cristo printing plate one-of-one. -one. Uh, so, really interesting box. For Again, for $15, when the price comes down to $15, if you're someone who is into the draft, is into um, being in pools, and someone who really enjoys, uh, you know, I guess these low-end products that focus on some of the players and prospects who don't necessarily make it, uh, then this is the product for you. Um, I happen to be Fulton Cards live and direct from Brooklyn, New York.